السلام علیکم ورحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ بردر اینڈ سسٹرس ٹو نائٹ وی وانٹ ٹو ریکگنائز اینڈ سیلیبریٹ اے ویری اسپیشل گروپ اے ویری اسپیشل گروپ آف یگ ایپک سائنٹسٹس ہو اگینسٹ آل آرڈس ان دیر ویری فرسٹ کمپٹیشن آف روبوٹکس وینٹ آل دا وے ٹو ریجنل فائنلس اینڈ آؤٹ آف ہنڈریڈ اینڈ سیونٹی سکس ٹیمس they came number sixth. Takbir. This journey uh, of these young, mashallah, scientists, it started back in October of 2021, about six months ago, uh, under the leadership of uh, Brother Abu Bilal, our previous uh, board liaison for education, and also Dr. Obeda and other volunteers. And subhanAllah, in a very, very short time, they decided to participate in this multinational competition. And uh, out of the 20 teams. So they ran this competition for almost three, four months. You might have remembered that we had the first event here in the gymnasium. Uh, in the first round, out of the 20 teams, they qualified to go to the second round. And then, then out of the second round, again from the many 20, 25 teams, they were chosen to go to the next regional round. And in the regional, they came, like I said, number six, mashallah. So what an achievement. And I want to thank all of you for your support. So our program is very brief. What we're going to do, inshallah, we're going to play a very small video. Then, inshallah, we'll have Sheikh Yasser come up here and distribute these trophies to these, mashallah, young uh, scientists. And then, inshallah, he will say a few things and we will conclude, inshallah. So with that, I'm going to request uh, all of the students, inshallah, to come on the front. I'm going to ask Brother Fazal Sayyid, who's our current liaison, to come here. I'm going to ask the coach of the team to come here, inshallah, as well. Let's play the video and then Sheikh, inshallah, if you can also come uh, so we can start the program. So with that, uh, can we play the video, Basir Bhai? Assalamu alaikum. I'm Uzair Said, the team captain of Epic Odyssey, Epic's very own FTC robotics team. So first, what is FTC? FTC is a technical competition where contestants make robots that are supposed to complete certain tasks in a most efficient way. It teaches us all how we can practically implement engineering skills like designing, 3D modeling, programming, and marketing. These are all skills that we can all use later in our career. So now I can discuss our journey. How did we get where we are? So over the past couple of months, not only did we go from an 11th seed position to fourth in the span of two meets, but we got to the point where we were able to redesign our robot within two weeks. And in the end, we placed second finalist in to on top of the entire meet. This was all done through the help of our team members who all stepped up made, like in such an incredible way since the beginning, where some of us programmers didn't really know how to program and now we're making whole autonomous and image recognition programs within the span of a night. And our builders were playing with Legos to start with and now they're able to design entire robots literally from nuts and bolts. In terms of our current status, the next step in our program, we're currently preparing to go to the super qualifier. And inshallah, we plan on doing the best we can in there and going to the regionals. Inshallah. Go Odyssey! This is the, the team captain, Uzair Saeed. Mashallah. Uzair. Uh, we have the 3D modeling team, uh, Ibrahim Arab and Ismail Arab, two yeah, twins. Two, 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 oh, yeah. twins. Two twins. <laughs> MashaAllah. MashaAllah. Two twins. Allahu Akbar. MashaAllah. Here, here, here. MashaAllah. Alhamdulillah. Now we have the building team, uh, which consists of uh, sister Sara, Sheikha, Anisa, Umair, Abdus Sabur, Rayan, Hussain. How many? How many we have? Four. Huh? Four. Four. MashaAllah. Masha We have two sisters here, mashallah. Now we have the programming team, the brains behind the thing, the robot, right? Abdullah Qureshi, Amin Chogal, and Ayaz Islam. Takbir, come on guys, Takbir is free. Takbir! Takbir! And uh, finally, the marketing, Musab Umair and Hamiz Iqbal. 
also i want to also congratulate and uh, you know uh, recognize all the parents who have helped in the robotics program mashallah they have dedicated day and night you know 8 hours on saturdays you know long nights uh, they have been supporting the children and especially our head coach uh, brother ashfaq and his team they pulled it and they uh, came you know through the whole program and being a rookie team they they came number 6 uh, it's a great achievement for our community and in that competition mashallah this was the one of the muslim teams we had two two other teams so this was one of the other muslim teams we had among the all the other non muslim i just like to say i just want to thank the whole epic community the epic administration and our shiyu here for really supporting us as well as the parents and then finally the team members like as i stated if you heard or not everyone here had a very tremendous journey like at the start of the year they knew like nothing and like now they're like that right there was built by all of these kids within a span of like two weeks. Mashallah. And Alhamdulillah. And then finally, like, I just feel like we should just thank um, both our coach, Ashfaq Uncle, and Dr. Ubeda for helping pioneer this program to begin with. Yeah, that's all. Mashallah, mashallah. Takbir. 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 Alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah. You know, I visited your team, was it three months ago, right? And I interviewed you guys, remember that? And what really impressed me, subhanAllah, was that they were teaching me mechanics and I have a degree in engineering. I didn't understand what was going on and they had to explain to me certain terms. They had to, to clarify, teach me. And I asked every one of them, did they know this stuff when they walked in? Because, you know, grade 8, grade 9, grade 10, I mean, like, how do you know all this stuff? And they all said this was literally training on the job. They started and they started learning about physics and about mechanics and about all of this stuff, engineering and robotics, here in our masjid, alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah. And this to me is reviving the real spirit of our faith. You know, we all like to say, but it is true, for 1,000 years, no more than 1,000 years, we really were the number one in the world in every single discipline. We were the chemists, the word chemistry, alchemy, alchemia, it comes from us. We were the astronomers, we were the biologists, we were the medical doctors. Wallahi, it is amazing and mind-boggling and sad to mention that Europeans would travel to Andalus to become doctors. We have documented evidence that from England, people would travel to Andalus to study medicine, to study philosophy, to study theology, and then they would go back. Some of the brightest minds in the 10th, 11th, 12th century, they studied either in Andalus, or from people who studied in Andalus. I was just in Belgium. I don't know if you saw the video and the, the, the Facebook posting I did that they have a dictionary of Arabic and Arabic grammar by somebody who studied with a, a scholar coming from uh, Andalus because they understood the value of Arabic language. Subhanallah, 500 years ago, things began to change. That's another story. But this type of project, it reminds us of our glorious past. This is not something that is abstract and, and alien. This is the reality of our tradition we thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala we have these bright minds we thank Allah that we're reviving this spark Allah wants us to have the best of this deen this dunya and the next and the earliest generation understood this within 100 years of the coming of Iqra it is true the first generation it took them a while they had Iman and they had the the, the, the foresight but within two three generations alhamdulillah uh, engineering technology medicine uh, chemistry all of these were being uh, in invented and discovered in Muslim lands. Within five generations, alhamdulillah, universities have already begun in Muslim lands. I have a whole talk about the beginning of universities. The first universities in the world in our lands, alhamdulillah. Unfortunately, what happened, happened, especially colonization and whatnot. So khair, we took a different turn, but we have to rediscover our roots. And inshallah ta'ala, it's going to be our young minds, our bright minds like this. And mashallah, I love your confidence as well, mashallah. All of your confidence, alhamdulillah. You know, they came sixth right sixth out of almost 200 that is the top 0.3 percent of the regional competition after having zero experience a few months ago 
to come and win not just the top 1%, the top 0.3% of the entire region. Alhamdulillah, thumma alhamdulillah. This means that inshallah ta'ala, the next time they're going to do it, they're going to be the top 0.1%. And inshallah, I'm positive with this enthusiasm and with this inshallah himma and with this confidence, you will be number one. But in our eyes, you're already number one because I have a guarantee that the ones who came on top of you, they already had much more background and training than any of you. I'm positive about this. Those that came above you, they must have had years. You guys had months. You guys had our facilities, which are great, but I'm positive those teams had much better and much more multi-million dollar facilities, but we're going to give them what they need. That's what we're about. We're going to make sure they have the support. We're going to make sure they have the infrastructure. We're going to make sure they have the equipment that they need. And we know they have the minds. You see this. We know they have the talent. We know they have the himma. We know they have the confidence. We need to provide them this infrastructure and support. And that's what we're going to do, inshallah ta'ala. So let's make a deal. Let's make a deal. We give you our support and you're going to make us proud. Deal? Inshallah. Inshallah. Jazakumullah khair brothers and sisters. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless them all to be number one next time. But as I said, in my eyes, you're already number one in our eyes. Alhamdulillah. So, Sheikh, so what is next? Uh, so those, inshallah, who are interested in, uh, in participation, uh, after summer, we're opening up registration for the robotics uh, uh, club, inshallah. So if you uh, you have kids who are interested in being part of the robotics club, please come and talk to Brother Fazl. We're going to have an open house. Also, in summer, we're starting a coding club as well, inshallah. So please uh, look for more announcements. Jazakallah khair. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.